All right, what's up, everybody? Um, I have a few gameplays that I want to um, upload and commentate, but I chose this one as my very first one. And first off, let me just get this out of the way. I realize um, I'm obviously not using a capture card. I don't have one. I am super ghetto, and I'm using a video camera, which is right next to me while I'm playing, um, which is awesome. But uh, I wanted to start with this game on Skid Row of Demolition and just to uh, introduce myself and everything because it's a pretty slow paced game. It'll start off slow and then I'll pick up some kills in the later in this round and in the second round. Um, and I also do the objective, don't worry. Uh, actually in the second round, not in this round, I'm not gonna lie. But um, basically my gamer tag is Sage25 uh, and I've been well, I've been playing Modern Warfare 2 since the day it came out, the night it came out. Um, I played some COD 4, but not too much. I'm familiar with it, and uh, but it got me into World at War. I played a lot of World at War. Um, just like I did this, I pretty much got 10th prestige in like the first month or two. Played the crap out of it. Um, and I'm, I'll always be uh, a Halo fan. I, I'm good at Halo. I like Halo. Uh, but for now, it is Modern Warfare 2, and um, I didn't know that. notice that guy defusing the bomb, by the way, and then I didn't notice that it was completely clear, and I could have armed it again myself. Um, but that's okay. Uh, <laughs> don't worry, I do the objective in the second round. Um, basically, um, I, I didn't know whether to upload this game or another one where I kind of go to town on the intervention, or with the intervention rather, on a, on a free-for-all. And I figured this one is kind of slow-paced and longer and I can introduce myself. And uh, I know, for me at least, I never get sick of tired, uh, um, or tired of watching videos of the intervention and some sweet quick scopes and whatnot. Um, but uh, that'll probably be my next video. Um, and I do use the snipers a lot. Well, not snipers. I do use the intervention a lot. This is that was a stupid death, um, and um, I use plenty of guns. I mean, I'll I'll upload videos with all kinds of guns. Oh, and uh, as I was saying before, um, I'm planning on getting a capture card in probably uh, the next month or so, so you won't have to worry about the video quality being like this the whole time. You can't even see like all of the radar or the time or anything. But um, I'm just hoping you guys will respect and enjoy the gameplay and hopefully the good commentary. Uh, this is my first commentary, so hopefully it'll be all right. Um, and maybe you learn a thing or two if you're not an experienced gamer or Call of duty -er, because I have played quite a bit of Call of Duty. Um, I got my 10th prestige on this game within, well, just over two months, I think. And... Um, I, yeah, I've put a lot of time into it. Okay, anyway, let's move into this um, this particular game here. Uh, you see, I just got Harriers. Uh, I wasn't doing too hot before that, and I thought that was an enemy. Uh, I wasn't doing too hot before this life, and uh, now I got a streak going. And the reason I'm not doing the objective here on offense is because I'm with five randoms, and... When I go in by myself and get matched up with randoms, I pretty much play uh, play to kill a lot. And I, I mean, I'm I'm objective minded, but the fact is, I I'm easily the best slayer. Like on this team, for example, out of this team of randoms, so my best the best option for us to win is for me to try and kill everybody, build up kill streaks, get air support in the air, and. Uh, let my teammates do the objective, which luckily they're doing this game, because sometimes you'll get partied up with randoms that will try to be doing the same thing as you and killing everything, but they won't be killing everything. And then everybody's just sitting back camping, and nothing, no objectives get done. Uh, luckily this game I had uh, decent teammates, and I think we're coming, yeah, the, the end of the round is coming here. We armed both the bombs. Uh, and I get, do I get a Harrier here for next round? No, but I have a, I think a Predator to start off the round. Um, and notice what I do here at the beginning of the round, by the way. Um, I switch to this class. Okay, 
don't blame me for having this class. Everybody has this noob tube class, uh, especially since I have 10. Anyway, the point is, the reason I switched to it is because it has danger close and one man army on. So my I, I use it um, for danger close pro so that my kill streaks at the beginning of the round here are more powerful. Um, but I'm not gonna go around noob tubing people. Uh, I use the one man army to switch back to my uh, scar class. Oh, which I should probably talk about by the way. Um, I, I like to use a lot of different guns, mainly just because I kind of have an OCD thing. It's not an OCD thing at all, but it's just a thing uh, in which like, I like having all the attachments on guns. I like getting new camos and whatnot. And so like on this one, I'm using uh, the FMJ. Uh, I'll just go through the class really quick. I'm using the SCAR H with FMJ, and it looks like the M9 with FMJ. I don't usually use the M9. I think I was just trying to get the akimbos here and check them out. Uh, I try to uh, go through different secondaries and I've pretty much tried all of them. But um, and then I have uh, claymores with flash grenades and then scavenger pro, stopping power pro and I think ninja pro and uh, which is pretty much a, a basic setup for an assault rifle class if you want to do a lot of killing. Um, it's probably the best choice. Um, so yeah, I I had the the Scar FMJ on. I think I was just trying to get extended mags, which is pretty good on the Scar. Uh, most people like the Iron Sight. I I like the Iron Sight on the Scar. So if you just want to go Scar extended mags, it usually works out pretty well. And you can see um, my payload is doing some work, and I'm at the end of the hall here, and I kind of get angry at this little sniper looking the exact same way I am and not doing as much work, you'll see me like, get away, um, like you're not doing anything. And I'll, I'll do that to people, cause it's annoying. And my Claymore gets that, saves his life, cause he, he, he would've gotten knifed, look at, he's oblivious. Um, you're welcome. Um, the host is terrible by the way, I don't, I have a terrible connection, I live in California. Usually East Coast hosts or like British hosts or something like that. Um, anyway, okay. So I got I got my kill streaks up. I got uh, my kills going and everything. So I'm like, okay, I should probably help my team win the game. Nobody's going to defuse it, so I figure I'll go over and and defuse the bomb. Uh, and then that guy comes in and takes me out. Uh, and then I think oh I try to I, I figure he's planting right now, so I try to get an FMJ kill there, but uh, I didn't have any luck hitting him. So I just finish him off with the M9. Uh, give me, give myself some cover. I, I saw my teammates had my back um, up in the building, and they could watch the playground and stuff. So I just claymored that door, and uh, gave me some cover so I could defuse again. Drop shot this guy, and I'm gonna post back up top again. I actually saw they armed A now, so I'm gonna um, clear it out. See if my teammates have cleared it out. I see this guy died. It's really important to look at your map and listen to listen to bullets and just the, the sounds. I have a headset, which I just recently got uh, in lieu of getting a capture card. So I went with the headset first. I get the disarm and then I see another X over here. So I decide to finish that guy off and it's already over. Um, so I end with the score of 43 and seven and I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, rate and comment. And uh, I would love to hear some feedback or anything and I'll, I'll get some more videos up soon. All right, thanks everybody.